Not even in frame. Now I'm just more sad. <sighs> Well, I guess I should stop. G'day guys, it's Dry here. Yeah, I'm not sounding the greatest. It's not because I'm sick. I'm sick of myself, you could say, but physically I'm fine. I felt like I wasn't being honest with you guys. And um, what I mean by that is, I'm always open with you guys. I want to tell you guys everything. I'm gonna try not to cry. I've not been in the best mindset these past couple of weeks, especially the past two weeks. I've hit an all time low, mentally wise, anyway. You know, physically, I'm fine. Spiritually, I'm fine. Emotionally, I'm a wreck. Mentally, I'm all over the place. You know, yes, I'm hanging out with my friends more. Yes, I'm seeing Jared more. And yeah, I'm kind of doing more things I want to do. But at the same time, I'm starting to lose it. I have been sticking to my focus this year, which was 2018. Is all about supporting my friends and making sure they feel like they're loved and cared for and feel worthy. Whether I do that, whether I have been doing that or not, that's up to them and what they think. But right now, I'm starting to think about myself, which never happens. And I'm tempted to take some time off of YouTube, but at the same time I don't want to because it's my escape. It's a place where I can go have some me time and just think. Sorry, and not have to think, just say whatever. Um, but it has definitely been a tough year this year, and I'll explain in the my life in 2018 video that will come out at the end of this year but I just feel like I haven't been open with you guys or at least I feel like I've been hiding stuff from you which isn't fair and I said it in a video over in the description that I would explain more on what's happening so later in this year a video will come out talking about A subject I've never dealt with before. So that will come out. But for now, I'm just going to give brief, very brief descriptions of everything. An incident happened not long ago. And from then onwards, it's just been a downward slope. I haven't been the same as I used to. In the sense of I just can't function. My mental health is so much worse to the point where I'm like, any little thing can set me off. Especially right now. Like something very little. And I just cried and cried all morning. Up until like, nine, 10 o'clock. I was getting ready for school and I just, I couldn't do it. I don't want this to affect my entire week, two weeks left of school that I've got for this term. I don't want it to affect me and this is why I wanted to talk. There's a lot of changes happening in my life. You know, I am finishing up cadets for St. John and if I'm going to be real with you guys and if anyone in St. John is watching this. I'm tempted not to come back. Not only the way that I've been treated, but the way my friends have been treated is just not acceptable. 
And it hurts me that... I've said this to you, but it hurts me because I used to say that place was my safe haven. And now I'm terrified. Like, no, I'm not terrified, that's extreme. But I'm just... I'm always... Like... When I go back. I want to be in a place where I'm surrounded with happiness. And honesty. And... If I'm not surrounded by that, I'd want to get out. That's why I left dance. Because I felt like I wasn't being treated well, and I wasn't. You know? That wasn't fair on me. If you want a what happened dance video, let me know in the comments below. But I just could not stand being treated like that anymore. So I decided to leave, and I feel like I'm getting there with St. John, which is funny because I'm turning 18 in, in like two weeks, and I don't know how I'm going to go. So clearly, I'm afraid I'm not coming tonight, let's do that. Clearly none of this is okay for you guys. It's not fun. Lately I just can't keep acting happy all the time. I'm so used to portraying happy all the time. This past week, two weeks, I just can't do it. I just can't be bright, happy, bubbly girl all the time who, you know, doesn't get innuendos or sexual jokes and is very innocent and doesn't know anything and doesn't want to speak her mind. And is, and is too afraid to say what she wants to say or she'll get yelled at. I want to start being myself, but what if people don't like the version of me? I really am tempted to take some time off. I've thought about it. Because it's not fair on you guys. And you guys have promised the content and don't get me wrong, I love making it for you guys. You guys are absolutely amazing and I appreciate each and every one of you. Um, shout out to my girl, Sunshine Draws. I appreciate you a lot. Um, there's some others as well, but I appreciate you all. But she's been very active lately on the channel. I just wanted to give a bit of appreciation to her, as well as the amazing fan art she's been drawing. Um, yeah. I just, you know, it's tough. I'll explain it more in a different video, but for now, I don't know when you're going to see this, actually. I have no idea. Um, let's just say next week, I'm not going to do any gaming video. I'm not going to record any gaming videos. There will be one last video that will go up, which will be on the weekend, which is a Sunday. For me, Saturday for the rest of the world. I'm trying to remember what that is off the top of my head, and I don't remember because I recorded it ages ago. So I've been scheduling those. Mm, I've been scheduling those videos, so I wouldn't have to stress about them. But I'm trying to think what it is. Oh, it's, I think it's the Carpool Karaoke episode 3. Not sure, don't quote me on that. But yeah, I think I might take a week off just to actually focus on my schoolwork. Find who I am. And I'll come back with a video that I'm proud of and I want you guys to see. Sorry if this is all over the place. And not what you wanted to hear. But, for me mentally to be stable, as well as emotionally, I need to take some time off. If I could, I would take time off of everything. Like, and I mean everything, like St. John, I would take time off of school, I can't do that. School I can't take time off of because that's my education. 
and I've got four weeks left. I can do it. Then I'll have a long time off before I even think about, well, until university hits if I get in. So for the moment, this isn't goodbye. This is just I'll see you soon. Think of it as a little vacation. This is not my job. I never said it has and never will be. I'm saying this is a no, this isn't a career either. This is a passion of mine, a hobby that I put so much time and effort into. I don't want it to be something I resent and hate. I've been doing this for a long time now. How long have I been doing this for? I think my video I first uploaded was 20... Oh, I should know this. I think it was 2014. So I've been doing this for four years now. Making content. This gaming channel hasn't been up for four years. This gaming channel's been up for what? This is its second year? I've put in so much hard work and effort. And I haven't ever taken a full break. There's been times where my uploading has been horrible because I've had no internet or other foreseeable things have happened. And I've tried my hardest even when I was at my lowest to get out content. But as someone who I aspire to be and I want to meet and just tell them this to the person who helped me create this channel and gave me hope and inspiration I know you'll never see this but I want to say it anyway to Jacksepticeye aka Sean William McLaughlin thank you for giving me a reason to start a channel and for meeting all these amazing people I've met Thank you as well for telling me that it's okay that you can take time off and seeing a therapist is a good thing when I thought it was bad. Thank you for spreading positive mental attitude around like it was sunshine and rainbows and confetti. Just thank you for being you and I really am thankful that you do such an amazing job. I don't know, he'll never see this, he'll never hear it. It's something I want him to know though if he somehow hears this. We're there for you when you're in your lows and in your highs and in between. Right now I'm just hitting my low. So I need to be there for my lows. I'm there for everyone else's. It's time to take care of mine. So yeah. I know this isn't what you guys wanted to hear but if you have any questions tweet me I guess or something like that. Write a comment and I'll reply anyway. We'll see. I love YouTube. Don't get me wrong. For my mental sanity, it's time to take a break. <laughs>